Hello everyone. For those who missed my name, my name is Vincent Feldman. I'm a GIS consultant at the office of the city mayor of Baguio. Um, we are in the process of mapping the city and um, in the introductionary video there was a lot of information I'm sure. If there's questions, just ask me. I'm always willing to answer questions, but in this video we are going to talk about the sign-up project. The sign-up is very simple. You start any internet browser, which in my case is Firefox, but it works with Edge, it works with Chrome, so whatever you're convenient with. You can use a desktop at the bar and guide, or you use a laptop, if you have a laptop on your own, great. But, in any case, the search bar here, you enter the website where we made our form, which is in the data request document you've got. It is bagyucityushahidi.io. Just enter it, and you will download the site. The site is hosted not in the Philippines, so it takes a bit, but as you can see, it's just a few seconds. Uh, here in the lower right, it asks for cookies, decline or accept. That's up to you. I click accept. I'm good with that. There will be a few pop-ups like this one, with some very brief information. It's actually not that relevant, but I would advise you read it at least the first time you see it. And just click on the yellow button, so read all these pop-ups, click on the yellow button, it's just a few. And good, once you went through all the yellow buttons, you go here on the left where it says login, sign up. You click there, then you see again login, sign up, make sure you select sign up. And here, you enter the name. Now this is, this is a part very important. I want the sign up to be simple, which means it's open for everyone to sign up. I figured that's the most easiest part to do this. But it also means fake people, maybe people who aren't even from the Philippines, if they coincidentally find this site, they might actually sign up. A bot may find the site and automate the sign up even. Bots do that. Bots can be made to create damage, to create chaos, and they may also then create fake data for us. Now to prevent this, I'm going to ask you to use a name which is very clear. One, the barangay name. Two, the Purok number and three, the poor leader name who's filling out this form. So in my case, I'm from Irizan, so I would say Barangay Irizan, then I add this connection sign, then I say poor 20, that's where I live, and here I would then use my name if I were the poor leader, but my poor leader is uh, Leticia the guy, um, but if I were the poor leader, I would write here my name, and that's it. Now if, if this form is going to be filled out by the secretary of the barn guy, great. Obviously you don't use the Puruk number then. You just say barn guy of Sun Rock Village, for example, and then here the name of the secretary. So if I were the secretary, secretary again I would use my name here. The thing is with this information I know this user is a legit user. The second thing I'm going to ask you is when you enter the email preferably use the Barangay email or a Purok email not your personal email but if you don't have such an official email then please use your personal email. Um, I already signed up under my email because I'm the administrator of this site, but I have um, I have a few fake emails which I use sometimes um, for cases like this, 
they're my throwaway emails. Um, pick your password. And click agree. The thing is, make sure you make a note of this, of your name. Make sure you make a note of the email you sign up with. And make sure you make a note of the password you're going to use. Uh, wait, I need to recreate that to make sure it's the right one. After you've done that, and you click on sign up, then that's it. You're now also logged in. On the upper right side, you can see that. Barangay San Roque Village, Vincent Feldman, and the email which you used to sign up. At this point, you are registered and you can use the form to enter the data. One last question I have, um, request, not a question. The request I have is that you send this data, but not the password, I don't need your password, but to send me the data, what is the email you used to sign up with? And what is the name you used to sign up with? That way, I can keep track of who is a legit uh, contributor to the data, who is actually a real Purak leader or Barangay official who enters the data, just in case we get some fakers or some bots finding the form and they sign up and they go create fake data. It's easy for me if I know who of you is legit what is your email and the name you signed up with, then I can easily kick out anyone who is not from Baguio, anyone who is faking data. It's then very easy for me to, and gone they are. So please make note, when you sign up, Barangay name, Purak number, and your name of the Purak leader, or Barangay, and then the name of the Barangay official, if you don't ask the Purak leaders, but you're going to do it yourself. And then you send to me that information, Barangay name, Puruk number, your name, and the email you used to sign up. And then we're good. That's the sign up pro uh, process. Uh, this is then the second video. I'm going to con conclude it here. The third video, I will then explain how to enter the data. That's then for the next one. So stay tuned.